Well, this is problem number eight for section 2.2. And this problem it says limits of the form limit as h approaches zero of f of x plus h minus f of x over h occur frequently in calculus. And we've already seen these in section 2.1. Evaluate this limit for the given value of x and function f. So what they want you to do is they want you to find essentially the slope because that's really what this does is it finds the tangent slope. So let's start by taking and using the equation. So limit as h approaches 0 of f of x plus h minus f of x all over h. And we'll start by plugging in our function. And we end up with x, I'm plugging x plus h into x squared, so it's x plus h squared minus the function itself, well that's just x squared, all over h. I'm going to go ahead and distribute x plus h squared, so it's x plus h times x plus h, and I get x times x, which is x squared, x times h, h times x, so I get plus xh and plus xh plus h times h, which is h, squared, so this is x squared plus 2xh plus h squared. Now I'm going to take this and I'm going to plug it in for x plus h squared. So you end up with equals limit as h approaches 0, x squared plus 2xh plus h squared minus x squared all over h. The x squared and the negative x squared cancel. And then I can actually factor an h out of these two terms. And I'm going to get limit as h approaches 0 of when I factor an h out, I get h. That will leave you with 2x plus h on top. And that's over h, which gives you the limit of h approaches 0, or as h approaches 0, this will cancel, and I'm left with 2x plus h. I'm going to plug in 0, and when I do get that, I get 2x. Now they want us to evaluate this or find the slope, so the slope is going to equal 2, and this is at uh, x equal negative 3, so I'll write that out. So this is going to equal 2 times a negative 3 which is negative 6 for a solution. That's the slope for uh, this x squared function at x equal negative 3.